Hey everyone, so let's go ahead and talk about the flow theme page settings that we have within our theme. Now I do want to point out that um, you will not find any page settings related to your home page, about page, contact, etc. All of those page settings are located within the actual page templates whenever you are creating those pages. Within this area specifically, we have a few very generic settings. For example, we can assign by default a sidebar to the left or to the right hand side to every single page within our website. Now if you leave this at full width, which is the default setting, you can always manually assign a sidebar whenever you are creating a certain page. You can then adjust the page title font style and you simply click here to select one of the predefined font styles provided within your theme or you can click on this little edit icon to edit a certain font style. As you scroll further down we have options for our search page and over here you can change out the search page title then you select the search page results layout and as you select a layout you will have options to make adjustments or customizations to the selected layout above. And uh, you'll also notice that we have four tabs at the top. One is for mobile layout specifically, where you can make a few adjustments to the background color and elements color, and then also enable or disable dates with categories or decorative images. If you head on over to the margins area, well you can simply add some additional padding to the top or to the bottom for desktop and mobile devices within the search page results area. And then miscellaneous, uh, this is pretty straightforward for all themes. Uh, you can hide certain blocks on mobile or desktop devices and then assign block IDs and block classes. Within the specific tab is where most of the settings will take place. As we selected this grid-like layout, there are a few options. You can select square images, masonry images, or just have it set to default. Then you can also adjust the gap between your images by simply drag and dropping this little toggle. Uh, you can adjust the number of columns and then make a few color adjustments here. Adjust the image overlay background transparency. And as we scroll further down, we can just make additional adjustments to our font styles and different uh, labels used within the search area. As we scroll further down, we approach our archives page. And the process is exactly the same as what we had within our search page. Uh, you adjust the archives page title, you select a layout, and then you can make adjustments based on the layout that you've selected. Once again, the options are identical. As we scroll further down, we approach our not found page options, and here you can basically change out the three different titles used within the not found results. So this is pretty much it in terms of the flow theme page settings. Thanks for watching this video guys, and I'll see you around later.